Now, if you want to have a really nice aquarium, you cannot rely on a service guy that comes once a month to do your testing, and you can't rely on a um, aquarium shop to just give you a free water test every now and then. You really want to get to grips with your own testing, particularly if you're inexperienced, because the changes that you need to make over time to your dosing re regimes and so forth, particularly in a new aquarium, particularly if you're not experienced, will be um, uh, more immediate than your monthly visit to the aquarium shop or even your monthly visit from an aquarium service guy. So if your aquarium isn't the way you want it, then you really need to take ownership for your own tank and you really need to do your own testing and you need to um, ensure that your, um, your um, changes to your dosing is very immediate, sort of like weekly, not like monthly instruction from an aquarium shop or a service guy often just isn't enough to cut it. Owning your own tests and getting used to your own tests and doing your own tests is something that you just can't be afraid of if you want to have this hobby to be successful. Like a lot of people will come in like once a month to get a bit of direction and wonder why their tank's not going well. You've got to be able to test it. Otherwise, you're... um. You're leaving it to fate, which might not be good.